Now go to file, go to build settings, go to Android, switch to platform. Add the open scene and go to player settings. There you go. Then go to XR plugin management. Check AR core. And then go to player and make sure you remove this Vulkan graphics API because it's not supported by Android. And then name it whatever you want to. Uh, you can name it uh, com dot your name dot XR code interaction demo one or whatever you want to. All right. And uh, minimum API level go for seven point zero or seven point one. Like the higher, you can keep it higher, but don't bring it below uh, seven point zero. Okay. Uh, Anything else? Uh, I guess no. Uh, so yeah, that, that's all. all. Right, build it and name it. Uh, name the APK whatever you want to. That's uh, uh, maybe. Well, I'm just gonna name it same as the project name. That's uh, XR Core Interaction Demo One. Yeah. So that's the name of the APK. And once it's generated. Once it's generated, we'll just transfer it to our phone. Okay, so there we go. We have the XR Core Interaction Demo One dot APK file, and now we're gonna transfer it. Connect your phone to your desktop, and then you can choose either your internal shared storage or you know your SD card. I'm just going to use my SD card and then uh, you can save it wherever you want to. I'm just going to save it inside SanDisk SD card experiments. Just make sure that uh, you, you you know it, the path, you remember the path and you're able to navigate to that path in your phone. Okay, so now we're going to be pasting that uh, copy and then just paste it. All right, and now you can test it. So go to your phone, go to files, and then go to SD card, uh, experiments, uh, XR core interaction demo one dot APK. Install. Open. 